In this video, I'm going to show you how you can track your music from your Mac. Okay, not a lot of people use this setup, so I need to explain a little bit of what I'm doing. So basically, Last.fm is a website where you can track the music that you listen to on Spotify from other devices, and it gives you recommendations and also something like Spotify Wrapped, like all the music that you've listened to and top artists and stuff like that. So if you're like me and you listen to music on, on Apple Music on, on the computer on iTunes and you want that music to be tracked as well along with the Spotify one, I'm going to show you how to do that. So the process of tracking the music on Last.fm is called Scrubble. So I'm going to show you how to Scrubble the music that you listen to on Apple Music into Last.fm in your Mac. Okay. I hope that makes sense. So basically, this is my summary, the last music that I was listening to. And if I start playing a song right here, let's play this, for example, then this will start tracking and it will be like, oh, you're listening to this song, for example, as you can see, waving R in the end, scrubbling now because it's playing right here. So what it's doing this is this extension or app called Scrubbles for Last.fm. And you can find it on the Apple Mac Store. Uh, let's see if I can just paste it, the name. This is the app. It's free. You can download it. And once you download it, install it, you will have to sign in with your Last.fm account. And once you do, then it's going to show at the top right here. So this music sign is the app itself. And it's going to track everything that you play here on Apple Music. So as you can see, I'm playing Armani White by Billie Eilish and it says Scrubbly now. And it's going to send all that information to Last.fm as well. And you will have it right here, Scrubbly right now, as you can see. You can set it up to record the song only after you've listened to like 60% of it or something like that. You can play around with all the settings um, here and it will also show you all the top artists. As you can see, I listen to a lot of Bad Bunny. Uh, top albums, top tracks, and stuff like that. So you can also, to Last.fm, if you didn't know, you can connect your Spotify account and whatever you play music, it can track that music as well. And then it will show you, for example, top albums this week has been damned by Kendrick Lamar, etc., etc. And you have a lot of reports. If you want me to show you my whole setup on how I deal with discovering music and track it on my music, I can make a separate video about that. Just leave it in the comments. But yeah, how to track your music on your Mac using Last.fm, you can use this extension called Scrubbles for Last.fm. I hope you found this video helpful, and if you did, please leave a like and subscribe to the channel. Have a wonderful rest of the day, my friends, and stay safe out there.